Whereas Johnny was throwing away his life with Sonic Adventure 2, or Sonic the Hedgehog 2, here is the game I was throwing away my summer and childhood on. <laughs> Welcome back to the Donkey Kong Universe, ladies and gentlemen, with your host. I'm Johnny. Oh, yeah. And I'm Matt. We're doing Diddy's Conquest. Yes. And I had to stop a bit to pronounce that properly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everyone and their grandmother always pronounced it as Diddy Kong's Quest. But nope, you're wrong. Everyone was wrong. Matt, your childhood is a fucking lie. Damn. <laughs> I guess I mean, there, oh, there, uh, yeah, uh, there goes my penis. Now I'm a girl. You're treating it like the whole boom. There goes your childhood. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pretty much. You know, it's like finding out. Uh, Click on the audacity file. What? <laughs> because that delay, that delayed footage is gonna get distracting. Okay, okay. Especially from the way I'm sitting. Like, but um, yeah, technical issues here. It's, 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 it's like discussing folks. about Peter Pan and its true nature. Anyway, so uh, unlike last time with DKC1, where I was pretty much at the helm with the big man DK himself, that's not the case here because DK has been kidnapped. Yeah, and welcome to a recurring plot of rare video games. Protagonist <laughs> of the last game gets kidnapped. Yeah. So, now, we the difference here, folks, is that Matt will be in, pretty much in charge of this. Uh, even though you guy. got the first battle? Uh, Yeah, but I'm going to be Diddy. All right. And you're going to be taking the home as Dixie. Right. It's another team game, folks. Just uh, one, real quick, for, real quick. Keep mashing down a two-player contest, Johnny. Do it again. All right. Cool. Cheat mode is where you're going to enter like a whole bunch of optional stuff you could do like either well not so much cheat mode per se but you got to like insert button combinations around here or there then you can actually enable stuff like uh, hidden checkpoint barrels or 50 lives or stuff like that. Use it where you can listen to the music in the game. Okay. I'd recommend that. The music in this game rocks. Awesome. All right, Wait. now if you want to go back to the two player team or contest. Does book? that th 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 is, does that book that Diddy's reading say sad hag? No, what that's supposed to be is the um it's all right, you know what that really supposed to be? What's that? It's out of because it's all pixelated now. But what that's supposed to be is the, uh, the um, it's like an arcade stick, you know? You held like the uh, Nintendo, and there was like six buttons here on the side, and then you held the joystick. It was that thing. Oh, okay, because it looks like some sort of magazine, because I see some sort of paper fold in the, in the corner there. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we are doing another two-player team, and unlike DKC1, we are going full 102% completion for this, uh, ladies oh, and gentlemen. Oh, plus two. Oh, yeah, we got yeah. badass. Well, DKC1 had 101%. <laughs> uh, and this, this one has to be 100%. So 1% makes a huge so difference. So we are going Fuck after yeah. every bonus room, we are getting every DK coin. I practiced somewhat. But Matt, I, did, I said I would, but then I got distracted by Persona 2. Yeah. <laughs> but Matt has enough experience with this already. I have faith that we'll get this. But we begin where we ended in the be in the end of the last game, Gangplank Galleon. Looking for clues. Yes. Welcome to Pirate Panic. By the way, one thing you're going to notice in this title is there's a lot of alliterative names. Uh, well, not alliterative names per se, but they're going to start both words in the team are going to start with the same letter. Like uh, Pirate Panic, Main Brace Mayhem, Topsy Turvy, shit like that. I could not the fucking ape. Hey, never see him again. Ha 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 ha. Where's I, my Smash Brothers place? Yeah, right? I would like to see K. Rule Smash Brothers, though. Fire Every, Panic here is real quick knows. to introduce you to some basic shit. The rat you could just jump on. And eh, Johnny just. I want to see someone quick. Okay, I can't. You can't tag me out like that. Here's a new thing tag moves. By pressing the A button on the virtual console here, so that's what we're play, using to play it on. Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, both players right, can tag out any player at any time. Dixie can fly in the air. This one I remember. Oh, by pressing the Y button in the midair. Boy, I wish I practiced on this. What's the coin? The coin is a banana coin. Basically, there's a lot of services around this time in the game this time around at the cost of fees. Johnny has, to, and we got to use that. We got to use the banana coins to pay him. There's plenty of banana coins splattered throughout the game, so we'll know we're exactly. Where, we'll, so we're never in our like worry that we're gonna miss anything. And they do respawn. Oh yeah, real quick to get him. That's a clobber. Can't kill him normally. Gotta bounce him. Oh, you got hit, John. I am hitting it. I don't know why the hell. Oh uh, yeah, you entered the, bo the bonus bar. You're the one that has to press it. Mm, I was hitting them and nothing went through. Oh well. Swing right down there real quick for a quick banana coin. Not all bonuses have them. I just hop up here to get your first prem coin. They don't seem like they're important now until you meet Clubba. Clubba we will see Clubba, plenty. Clubba rang. <laughs> Clubba Bubba Rang. Voiced by Mr. T. Here's a new thing that was added in DKC2. Animal Super Moves. By the way, Rambi, welcome back. I love you. Too bad this is the last game we're going to see you. <laughs> but holding on the A button, Rambi will charge up. Let loose and he rents through everything like, well, like a rampaging rhino. <laughs> you need to use the A button thing here again to get this secret. <laughs> just to take out the door and then just walk casually. Right. Yeah. Bonus, there are a hell of a lot more bonus rooms. 
in the in this game compared to DKC one, and they all have pretty much a, a purpose this time compared because you know the only reason why you got bonus rooms in DKC one was to add it to the percentage meter. However, there are purposes for the bonus rooms in this one, and they are but the, the coins. The crown coins. Yeah. Okay then. That's pretty much all that there are to it. And there's also DK coins. These are just empty percentages. But we're going to want him to shut Cranky the fuck up at the end of the game. And I know you guys are looking forward to that. Unlike other games, however, there's a set point where the animals can't go past. So Rambi here dematerializes into a balloon. It gives us two lives. Bananas work. Bananas. The lives work the same way. And Diddy runs on ahead while I rip a sweet track. <laughs> It's like, why, By how, the way, how is one, the... Lo one loving track I love in this game's soundtrack is that every musical piece like that with the, uh... Go ahead, Johnny. Before yeah. I get into that, if you see the exclamation point, you're done with all the secrets. You see the DK coin, you found the DK coin. Now we go to Main Brace Mayhem, our first rigging level. No, what were you saying earlier? How is it that Dixie's hair is like Sindel's? Uh, There's a secret down there, Johnny. Yep. Yeah. We're going to go there right now. Actually, I'll show some DK. You can do it with uh, the cartwheel jump right there. Diddy is more mobile than Dixie. But Dixie can fly, so that's really kind of a moot point. And that's why everyone <laughs> likes Dixie more than Diddy. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that hovering ability she, alone. That hover ability alone helps in a fucking platforming game. It's like playing a Sonic game where Sonic decides to rip out the fucking rocket launcher. <laughs> <laughs> All you gotta do is climb up here, and Johnny gets the first grim point of the level. How many are in each level? Uh, give or take two or three. So it always varies. Yeah. Uh, uh, D uh, DK emblems are not going to be a priority, folks. If we find them, we find them. If not, if not. If know. what? If uh, DK, uh, 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 Kong emblems. Oh, yeah. It's a banana there, token. There are... Banana tokens we just told you there. What you used... Oh, wait, hold on. Johnny, uh, drop me off. Switch me in. One second. I love that sound. <laughs> Whoops. I like the uh, Donkey Kong Jr. homage there with the rope climbing. Yeah. Yeah. Let's remember the ledge. Yeah, I think yeah, you're jumping you're in. just a bit ahead. Yeah. That's fine. We're, we, I'm I, anti, I, I love this I, game. Yeah, I, I'm a bit anti too because we, again, we are playing this live. Right. You can just cartwheel through all of them if you want to, but the barrel's more splat. I guess I suppose you don't want rap blood on your foot, do you? <laughs> Hop up on that banana, banana. Ooh, back up, back up, back up. Hop up on that banana. Grab it. Booyah! Oh, two up. And that's why Matt loves this game. Because I found that one two up. <laughs> uh, here's a new cannonball. The, if you find are... a cannonball, oh, there is most likely a cannonball, uh, a cannon launcher. Oh, it's just a cannon. Period. Somewhere nearby. If you put the cannonball inside the cannon, it launches into another bonus room. Right. Now, if Johnny's really good here, we can manage to get them all in one shot with the, with the barrel over to the other side. Johnny's not going to chance that. No. I'm going to throw you. That's one thing you could do as well. You could throw your partners into enemies and do damage with them as well. You got plenty of Doesn't time. work for every enemy, though. Yeah, if, if you throw me into a bee, because I have a feeling we're going to get a fucking doing that at one point or another. <laughs> If you end up throwing your partner into a bee, you lose your partner and you get to feel stupid. Now you're going to need to jump over there if you can tag me in. I'm going to need you to... Uh... No, you don't. You can make the jump. Let me go back down here. I'm Johnny, just... you can make the jump. Better safe than sorry, huh? Yes. Alright. Nine like... times, Matt. <laughs> Nine fucking times. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> the curse. The, the DKC one curse. We uh -oh. recorded that game nine fucking times before we got a successful playthrough. Oh, Jesus. Damn dazzle days. <laughs> now we collect the stars. By the way, the bonus games aren't really varied per se. You got one of three variances. However, they are all fun, for the lack of a better term. Now, if you hold it like this, you go up very slowly. Do it like this going down, however. And you go down at breakneck speed. Yeah. Well, breakneck as far as this game's concerned. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is too much for me. Uh, yep. I think I'll get you motion sickness. Emotion sickness? Motion. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, got a little paranoid there, but now, with all the stars collected, we are out of here. Oh yeah. It's all about the motion of the ocean. Uh, one thing that's really good about DKC2, don't feel too distraught if you fail a bonus game the first time. You get plenty of chances with them, for the yeah. most part. And the if the you... cannonball's a little trickier, though. The, the cannonballs are trickier because they require the more of a setup to get to than a regular bonus barrel. Right. But if you fuck up any bonus barrel game, you can go right back to it. Exactly. We're done Main Brace Mayhem. Now, if you head up north, Johnny, please. Thank you. We go to Monkey Museum. Here's a place where you can go get some more hints, as well as you can endure more emotional abuse from Cranky. <laughs> <laughs> Back Here's what I've got to offer. Some of his, some of their tips are free. Sometimes they'll cost you. Uh, usually, if they cost you, they're going to probably reveal some more hidden goodies. But would you, would you like some tips and rumors for two dollars? <laughs> <laughs> Don't buy tips and rumor. Don't buy tips and hints for two dollars. <laughs> 
Good thing we're playing with coins. Uh, let's just uh, demonstrate one. Yeah. So, well, Pirate Pan we already cleared out. Let's do a uh, top sail trouble. Okay. A hook, step, and a jump is all you need to look for near the two dragonflies above you. That'll reveal. That means there's a hidden hook in the level. We just need to find two dragonflies to get to the pin. Yep. That's not really going to be the only time I think we're going to go visit him unless we want to get more abuse. I re I <laughs> right on down, Johnny. I remember back when banana coins all cost. Right. We're made actual bananas. Tag me in real quick. Now we're gonna do this level twice, guys, because there's something I want to show off. Oh, uh, I see. You want to show off the yep, warp? There it is, the warp barrel. There's a. This is like one of the only warp points in the game here. Basically, you can come in here, do this, and then all of a sudden time flies and you're done. Yep. The hell? A lot of levels have warp barrels, but actually, no, they don't. A lot of levels have. I've, I've watched those speed runs. There are a lot of warp barrels. Then there's a lot of them I missed, and there's still stuff the, to learn about the game. That's what I was just getting into. A lot of them are obscure as fuck. You would okay. never ever think about going there. Alright, then that's good to know yeah. in the future. However, that's not what this playthrough is all about. So if you want to hop in that first bonus barrel there. Here you got to be quick. There's going to be four chests and a red zinger. Bust all the chests across the zinger. I think it's the second Good aim. No, it's not always the second one. It's always Oh, random. it's always randomized. Because nice. I had three separate test playthroughs where it was always the second chest. I guess it's just Nintendo's way of decking me. Alright, just uh, tag me in, bro. After you kill him. You murderer. <laughs> one little detail that to, uh, to attention I love. That's one thing I love about this game in particular compared to DKC1 is that there's a lot of little subtle... I want to say subtle, but there's a lot more nice little details to attention. And for me, that could make all the difference. Like, if you knock an, if you kill an enemy here, they splash right in the ocean below. Yeah. If you not kill them in the lava, they go up in smoke. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so who cares? They're all Kremlings. Yeah, they're yeah they usually reproduce. <laughs> Especially the bees. They don't ever go away. This level here. Thank you, Avast. That's like six playthroughs, Avast. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's trying to tell me my soft. It's trying to tell me your shit's bugged. <laughs> you can hop up here to grab the secret out. There's also a lot of uh, chests in this level too, so feel free to like bust a few open on some enemies' heads. Quarter round time and shot him. Well, it was more of his peg leg, but okay. Right. This here is a crusher. Try jumping on him. He gets pissed. Oh, yeah. Why don't you give him a team throw, Matt? Indeed. Hey, buddy. Catch. Ah! <laughs> think fast! That was my head, you jerk! You didn't think fast. <laughs> now, I'm trying to remember where one secret is. I know it's not down there. Uh, it's at the very end where, at the all, very the, end, right. where all the crushes are at. Right, that's the one I was thinking of. Thank you. I gotta say, I like, I like the track considering the fact, like, um... It, yeah, DKC2 has a real kick-ass like, soundtrack. Like, it actually sounds like a pirate track, you know what I mean? Right. Yeah, they're really playing at the pirate motif with this entire game. Oh, yeah. It's like King K. Rule had an identity crisis. <laughs> <laughs> now, this one you gotta be quick on, but careful. You have to press the one, dude. I can't press it. I keep pressing them and it's not going through. Or, or it just goes by itself. Yeah. Or, or it, it goes by, go itself. Yeah, by itself. Yeah, it Just gotta hop along the hooks here. Hooks are a new thing in this game. Basically, if your monkey hot grabs onto a hook and they automatically grapple right onto it. The no button press hair. needed. Diddy with his tail. <laughs> your monkey. <laughs> monkey. Now, you said it was down there on the left? Oh! oh. <laughs> no, I think that leads to death. <laughs> that's, a, that's a great Yeah, there's secret. something down there. The bonus of oh, the no great secret. beyond. My bad. Yep. 